Tonight's top story, intense downpours led to flash flooding last weekend in Wells County. People are now left cleaning up the muck, which even led to a road washout. KX News reporter Sanji Milburn tells us how one resident nearly lost his life. When the water got high enough, I took a CB radio hat in there and I smashed the window out, let the water in, and then I was able to open the door and get out. That may sound extreme, but the radio made a difference between life and death for 64-year-old Leo Laub after he was stuck in a ditch on Highway 200. It happened so fast that there was no time to think. It all happened in a split second. Friday night, he was driving his pickup down the road, and when he was washed away by flood water, his car sprung out of control, and he didn't know if he would make it out alive. The guy stopped and picked me up, thank God, and uh, everything's all right now, and they, they've come out and uh, retrieved my pickup and start over. Last weekend, it was scheduled to rain, but the amount was something no one saw coming, and residents could barely get in and out of their neighborhoods. Wells County had seven inches of rain causing a massive flood, but the water was so powerful that it washed away a 15 foot section in the road. Now crew members are left picking up the pieces. It, it worries you when you're, you're a responder and you know you have to think on your feet and you know you, you don't want to hear anybody hurt, but these things happen and I'm glad everyone's okay. As for Leo, his car and personal items may be destroyed but he says he's lucky to see another day. Reporting in Bismarck, Sanji Milburn, KX News. So scary. The North Dakota Department of Transportation will fix Highway 200, hopefully in the next couple of days. But for now, the stretch between Hertzfield and U.S. Highway 52 Junction remains closed.